So first of all, don't laugh. Second of all, if you have a brand new baby and you're desperate to get your active life back, tune right in. We've got Robin Borowski back again. Hello. And I brought my um, pink pram. No, Rob's, <laughs> Rob's brought us a pram to show us some incredibly interesting exercises, ways that you can get the body active again, get the mind active again, and take your beautiful little tot out into the brave new world. Show them that you are as committed to a healthy life as they should be. So what do we do? Where do we begin? Okay, Thanks for well, the pink pram, by the way. I thought it was super <laughs> so really And this is as much for fathers as it is for pregnant women. Okay, let's go. Or for okay, new so moms. Okay, time's restricted, energy's restricted, combine it while your baby's in the pram, they're having a good sleep, or they're just relaxing in there. First thing to do, start off with a warm-up. You can walk around. Okay. And we'll get straight into our lunge set. So holding that pram in front of you, activate that tummy. You take a nice step forward, making sure knees are now at that ankle, not over the toe. Bend okay. Like knee down, keep the baby tight. We come I'm back, back up. Whoa. And again, Easy, baby. Try not to let the baby come up there. Hold it there and slowly come back. So you could do about nice. two on each side all the way there and come back. If you have a lot of space, if you're on the promenade or something like that, you can take it into the And just keep moving forwards, like yeah. And always watching that form. Let's take it into the next You're one. right there. <laughs> cool. So we take it into a nice squat one. So okay. Toes are slightly out. You stick that thumb right back, keep that chest up. When you come up, activate the thighs, activate those glutes. Oh, Beautiful. you've got a little microphone to use there. Brilliant. So got to have a voice. Squatting mm. down all nice. the way. Stick that bum right out and standing up, holding this one down. So now, a lot of ladies tell me that they complain with their upper back from all the breastfeeding. Yeah. So you're going to keep the elbows close to you and you bend both arms back and squeeze it forward and squeeze back. So you're clipping the shoulder blades nice. going nice. Oh, you feel that pinch in the center of your oh, back. Oh, yes. Eh? Hello, upper back. Good. Very nice. Nice. So you can do quite a few reps of that and we'll take it into our nice bum. This is, yep, this is one we were practicing earlier. Beautiful yeah. plie. Right. So now we'll go down. Stretch those arms forward. Nice. There we go. And coming back. Stretch those arms forward and coming back. Holding That's this one burn, down. That's a burn, eh? Oh, yeah. So now, go. you're going to hold that hold plie down. down. Yeah. Hold there for quite hold a while. It. Lift these arms up and you're going to squeeze it back. So similar like we did earlier, but we just work a bit higher into that back. Nice. Perfect. Pulling those knees back. Nice. There you go. Look like you could do this all day. And coming up. Coming back so up. So now cool. we've done those for you, you want to always get a good stretch in. So holding that pram for support, you pull that foot up, stretch into that quad. <laughs> Almost all came crashing down. <laughs> it, it does help a huge amount with the stabilization, with getting the movement right. Just to have that guideline, to, to have the pram actually helps a huge amount. Definitely, and you can also stretch into that glute if you want. So, of course, you would do both sides. And after that, you would kind of get that leg on top and get down into those glutes, into those hips. So, holding there, and you would do both sides. Always making sure you get that stretch afterwards so you get the balance between strength and flexibility. And flexibility. Well, I know she has got more coming out of that big brain of hers. This morning we're going to get into more little fitness tips, ways that you can get your, your mind, your body, your holistic health back on track after the arrival of the little one. All right, time for another language lesson. We've been loving immersing ourselves in all of the beautiful cultures of South Africa. What's the next lesson, Kat? 